Hey guys, what is up and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a really quick speed deep clean with me. So go ahead, set a timer for 10 minutes. That's all you have to do. Just get done with as much as you can. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you my current routine in my new temporary apartment. So let's go ahead and get it done together. If you are new here, hello, my name is Katie. I make a lot of shop with me videos. That's definitely my favorite type of video. We have Target Tuesdays, anything to do with Target, home goods, and a lot of decorate with me videos to come. I also really love making these cleaning videos sometimes, so if any of that interests you, definitely make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. that I said new temporary apartment so please feel free to not look at absolutely anything that you see or any decor because this is not a reflection of what I want to do in our real apartment but we're just living that temporary apartment life trying to get by and we didn't want to decorate too much but honestly as the weeks have dragged on I needed some of my fake plants to cheer me up about living in a shoebox. Just kidding about the shoebox part it is a really really nice apartment but sometimes it just feels a little bit claustrophobic with two adults who work from home and three rowdy dogs. Because we're living in a temporary unit we've chosen to not open a lot of our new gadgets and gizmos that we got for Christmas and over Black Friday and stuff but one thing I could not wait to break into was my new Hoover Power Dash Pet hard floor cleaner this thing is literally essential if you have a lot of hard floors and any pets or high traffic areas but more on that later Brian and I are both pretty big neat freaks but in different areas of the house he really likes for the bedroom to be clean for the bed to be made and I'm definitely a crazy person about like main living areas like kitchen living room I definitely need those to be clean but with our current living situation our mattress is currently on the floor so no matter how much you make the bed flip the pillows it just always kind of feels messy and unmade and we're also both sharing one closet with absolutely no room for shoes so I would definitely say that our current living situation has taught us how to kind of let things roll off our shoulders when it comes to cleanliness. Okay, I can't blame this one on the apartment and I know it's not just me but our kitchen island is a catch-all and it is one of my biggest pet peeves I just feel like if it's messy then my whole life is messy and my whole apartment looks messy so it's definitely high up on my list of priorities every single day to try and be conscious about keeping it nice and clean
guys love doing the dishes, hate doing the dishes. I feel like I kind of fall somewhere in between. I don't really love doing the dishes because I'm weird about getting my hands wet. I don't know, it's this whole weird thing. But the satisfaction of having like a clean and empty sink and a dishwasher full of clean dishes to put away is just really, really satisfying to me. So I don't mind it that much. But definitely let me know where you stand on the doing the dishes scale and let me know down below what is your least favorite household chore and what's your favorite. It's always interesting to see what people love and what people hate because we're definitely gonna get to one that I absolutely hate. and find oddly satisfying but there's something about the floors in these apartments I think it's the vinyl all of our pet hair really just sticks and clings to it so we really will need to use a vacuum to get it all up but I love to do this before I use my new Hoover Power Dash pet because I don't want to clog up the system but what I absolutely love about this is it deep cleans your floors it's like a mop but you don't have to break your back to do it I've had steam mops in the past that you literally have to press down so hard but with this you don't as you push forward the cleaning solution comes out and then as you pull it back it scrubs the floors with a scrub brush and suctions up all of the water so your floors end up completely dry and super super clean you get to like clean out the dirty water tank and it's just really satisfying so I've really really enjoyed this product so far I will say the only thing I wish I could change is that I wish it was cordless but other than that I totally love it check out my link down below if you are interested in trying one of these Hoover products and thank you so much again to Hoover for sponsoring me on today's video you guys I absolutely loathe folding laundry I'll be honest most of the time Brian does this because look he's refolding what I folded for him it's just not my thing definitely more of his chore but at least I was in good company we like to separate everything out into smaller piles into different categories of our closet and then fold those that's just what works for us but honestly I'm not sure if it saves us any time <laughs> Honestly, as much as we crack jokes about it, working from home is such a huge blessing for Brian and I. This time last year, I was working at Disney. I was working 13 or 14 hour days, five days a week, and it was great for the phase of life that I was in then, but I just cannot imagine going back to that. So I just want to say thank you all so much for being here and supporting my channel. It just means so much to me, and I'll never be able to thank you enough, but that is going to be it for me today. If you haven't yet, definitely make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Please hit the subscribe button if you haven't yet. Check out the links in my description if you are interested in Hoover and I will see you next time. Bye guys!